Hello, everyone. The next day. Welcome to the jobs. I Oops. Cut it. I gotta find welcome to jobs. Day. And uh, welcome to Mafia 2. 7. Mafia 7. That's, 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 that's late in the future. Turn on the light. There's a light. I didn't know we had such fancy stuff in oh, in this place. Oh, shit. Look at us. We fucking fancy, dude. Yeah, with our leather, kind of leather jacket, oh, I, I think. So you have to go back soon? Actually, uh, looks like I won't. Uh, Joe's taking care of it for me. Joe, you want to get into trouble again? Mama, would you rather me go back and get shot again? No. Exactly. No. Joe probably saved my life. Promise that you won't get in any more trouble with that, Joe. You know, your papa used to work for this man at the waterfront named Papa Lardo. He's in the union. You could talk to him. Your Playing this game makes me want spaghetti. Your papa. Honestly, talk I'm pretty hungry for spaghetti right now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Not even as an Italian joke. Also, I'd like to point out that guy's name is Papa Lardo. Which I believe an Italian is fat father, <laughs> fat daddy. Are you sure? I, I, Papa is father. Lardo, mm, doesn't take a huge genius. Well, no, like Lardo, is gonna, that is that Italian? Like, let's is, let's call him. I thought that was just like slang. Let's call by him Fat Americans. Daddy. Let's call him Fat Daddy. All right. It, it it's it. I'm not gonna say it's it's an inappropriate name for him. Oh, is it? Okay. Well, I haven't seen this guy yet. Spoilers. Is he huge? Fat Daddy. I'll be your fat daddy any day. Hey, you. Uh, is there a bell that I can ring? No, there. I, I mean, there is, but I can't ring it. Wow, oh. game designers, get it together. Oh, hey. Rude. What? What's your Fucking name? Mike. Mike Monty. Stupid name. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I'm allergic to douchebag names. All right. We're outside now. And I now we've got to see. I don't care Look at the money. Sell hey. I promise. What the hell's going on here? You mind your business, no. asshole. Oh, yeah? Yeah. He just, like, rips his finger off. Come on, I'm gonna take you to school. Oh, <laughs> tough guy. Scaring a woman, huh? Come on. Show oh. <laughs> Come on. Oh, God. Jesus, fuck. Ah. Take that. Oh, right in the fucking face. Whoa. There. Take that. Be the what you doing? Hey, Gaspachi. Haha. -ha. Teach this idiot a lesson. I like that. Ow. Oh, shit. Damn. Please, Vito, oh, fuck. Oh, God. <laughs> hey, put up your dukes. Put up your dukes. Ah. Ooh, oh. epic dodge. Epic dodge. Man, this oh, guy this guy's it. really taking the hits. Trouble, Take it. Oh. Ah. oh. Yeah, get up. Get up, bitch. This is... Stop, stop, oh, fuck. He's dead. <laughs> Never mind. That's right. Get the fuck out of here. You're gonna be sorry. The both of yous. The both of yous. I love it. Who's yous? Yous. We didn't want to bother you with this. Bother me? Bother me with what? Come on, tell me what's going on here, Frankie. Right before he died, Papa borrowed money. A lot of money from a loan shark. Thinking he'd get a better job and pay him back. We found out right after you left for the war. That's not how you take loans. How much? Two thousand. It's like, yeah, I could probably pay that back at some point. <laughs> Shit. Oh, yeah, I love like 1940s money. She's like two thousand dollars, and he's like, oh fuck. But by today, it's like, oh, that. I mean, that's not great. It's not. You know, that's not that bad. I could probably make that back in like a month or two. Yeah. Yeah. It's okay, Vito. We'll manage somehow. Don't worry. I'll take care of this. Like seriously, Oops. these days all you gotta do is suck a couple dicks, and you probably that's two thousand dollars right there. Yeah. Yep. If you have like no standards, you could probably make two grand pretty quickly. I'd say so. Just on YouTube, you could probably do it. Yeah. If you don't want any free time, just get like two jobs, make you know, suck a couple dicks. Pretty two thousand dollars in like a month and a half. Not even that. Like I'm just saying, like just do something really fucked up on YouTube. Just like make a hair cake. Oh yeah. And eat it, because that's the thing. I fuck. That is the most disgustingly hilarious video I've ever seen. Yeah, I haven't seen it. I'm aware of it. I don't want to be. I wish I wasn't. It's awesome. <laughs> Look it up, everyone. We have different standards, Jake. 
<laughs> For example, I don't normally go about punching old ladies. That was kind of the one I wanted to go after, but evidently I'm not allowed to. Oh, I can sprint. Hey. Watch it. You watch it. I'm going... I'm a, I am a soldier. That guy was also a soldier. I'm more of a soldier, though. Oh, shit. That's some fucking... Hey, excuse me, Mr. Homeless Man. You look homeless. You're you're stumbling. You're old. And you have those weird, like, homeless people gloves on. Look at that. Those, those, those that is such a thing. I've never thought about that. Why, why, why do I just have regular gloves? <laughs> why do I just wear regular gloves, homeless people? All the homeless people watching this video right now, tell me. Leave a comment. Like, comment, and subscribe. Why you... Where oh, are the weird half gloves? Where's the where's the taxi? Hey, taxi! Hey, taxi! Can you? Oh, he's like, oh fuck, gotta get out of here! Oh, it's an Italian. Gotta get out of here! <laughs> Dirty what Italians. What are the Italianos? Yeah. Italians. It's okay to make fun of Italians. Is it? These days, yeah, sure. They're mostly white. <laughs> so I mean, how do I? How do I? How do I call you? God call me. God, there was probably a car that I probably could... Ah, whatever. I'll just run. I'll just run there, Do everyone. Do you take cars GTA style on this? Yeah, you can. Really? Um, yeah, you're able to. Uh, the thing is... Oh, well, it doesn't matter. Like, I'm right here. Wow. You're sturdy. <laughs> Damn, lady. You're a stout woman. I don't think any woman ever wants to be called stout. Yeah, no. That one. That's more definition. It does. That's how you know. Just like in real life. Ah. You're just fucking you're playing through this shit. No, oh, there's a lock on it. I go upstairs. That's how I do things. It does look brighter. Wait, where the fuck are we going? Places. Ooh, damn. See? Ooh, there's like a little light. Ooh, there's a thing out there. We're not going... Uh, no, yeah. It's uh, one more floor, I think. I believe. I, I'm not sure. It's been a long time since I played this game. Do you know where Joe Barbro lives? To the right of the stairs. And tell him that racket last night has to stop. If he don't like it, he can find another place to live. That's such like a 40s exclusive accent. Yeah. Like smoked for years. Like has yeah. lung cancer but doesn't know it because they haven't invented cancer yet. Uh -huh. <laughs> this is a bad time. <laughs> We're not at all. Come on in, let's talk. Uh, you disgusting pig. I picked up these broads on my way back from the store. I've been waiting for you. All right, girls, that's it for now. I got business. Stop by tomorrow, okay? We'll pick up where we left off. Chop, chop. Come on, Joey. Why do we have to stop when we can all have fun? The fun's over, baby. Later, I said. Me and Vito here haven't seen each other for a long time. We got a lot of catching up to do. Looks like you're doing okay. Are they just walking out into the hallway <laughs> like that? Do they just like walk out the door? I think so. Just walking out the street. <laughs> the one girl doesn't even bother to put her panties back yeah, on. Yeah, I know. She's, that's what she is. And you know how she is. She wants me to get a straight job. You're going to look for one? I don't know. But I sure as hell ain't going to make the same mistake my old man did. I got to pay off his debts, then get back on my feet and get my own place. I need to make some real money, and punching the clock ain't gonna cut it. Hey, you can stay with me as long as you need to, and we'll find you a job where you can make good money without killing yourself, all right? Music to my ears. Right now, I'm living off the 20 bucks the state gives me every week. <laughs> I know lots of people who pay well for a risky job, so to speak. I'm sure I can line something up for my oldest friend. The working man's a sucker, that's for damn sure. You said it. Okay, step one. I gotta introduce you to Giuseppe so we can pick up them discharge papers. Let's go. What do you think uh, 20 bucks is the equivalent to now? I was trying to think about that, yeah. I think it's like a couple hundred. Which it definitely isn't enough. Yeah. Three months. Not for him, but yeah, hmm. Really? That's his, that's his bra. Hold up his man titties. Needs some support, you know what I mean? Wow. Oh. <laughs> I can't. Uh, I'm trying to look at. Uh, uh. Get me. Get around. The, uh. If they're seeing the two broads that just left, I wouldn't touch that thing if you paid me. <laughs> Man, this is a classy gentleman, huh? Very. I'm stuck in a safe. Oh wait. Uh, nope. Nope. 
Hey, let's be a hey, light, hey, conserve energy. <laughs> you don't know it yet, but man, we're about to fuck the earth in like 30, 40 years. Oh, there's a fan? We'll turn off the fan. Where's the Where's the light switch? I want to conserve energy. I'm I'm going. We're going green, oh, damn, Joe. Uh, sleep. Yep. All yours. We're going green. I don't <laughs> care if, how you feel about it. I don't care if we're criminals. Go ahead. We gotta be conservationists. Even though we didn't, we don't even even know about the environment yet. Really, in the forties, know this. about fossil fuels. You got your own phone. Yeah, and now you do too. Can't do business without it these days. These days. These days. All right, go downstairs. Do we have televisions yet in the forties? Televisions, yeah, they were a thing. Were they? Yeah, I mean, obviously not color. They were like black yeah, and white. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But well, hmm. Yeah, right. I'm trying to think. Thought it was like a '50s thing. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that actually is a '50s thing. The more I think about it. So you thought about what you're gonna do now? If there were you television sets that in that the '40s, thing. it was like very novel. You like know, only like the big richest big people. Yeah. Had them, I guess. Not not really. Well, besides the usual, you know, find a nice girl, settle down. Whoa. Hey, there's gonna be plenty of time for that shit later. Right now, I'm gonna make sure you live a little. Hey, uh, you think I could, uh... What? Drive, Vito? The roads are icy. You ain't never drove a car before. Joe, I was driving almost the whole time I was over there. Yeah, but this ain't no tank, Vito. This is one of the nicest cars money can buy. I didn't drive a tank. I drove a Jeep. What the hell's a Jeep? It's, uh... Never mind. It, you're gonna let me drive a while. All right, all right. Here's the keys. Just be fucking careful. All right, when it's cold as fuck outside, you gotta give it a little more gas than usual. That's the pedal over there on the right. I know, Joe, I know. <laughs> That'll buff right out. Pulls out immediately, <laughs> slams in the wall. Just hits a person. He just hits a kid, like, immediately. <laughs> Alright, so there's, like, a, a speed limit thing. Because, like, if you're speeding, you will get caught. Yeah, there it is. Which, I don't know. I don't know how I feel about it. The thing is, like, the world isn't that giant, so it's not a huge deal. Yeah. Alright, you fucking loser. Sorry. Hey, I told you this ain't no tank. Be careful. That guy's really sliding away, You think people just habitually crash tanks? Like, that's just, like, a typical thing. This ain't no tank. You can't just go smashing it into shit. I wonder if I run the red if they care. No, I don't give a shit. They only care if you uh, speed. You know, you really wasn't too bad behind the wheel. You still use a little practice. Oh. <laughs> yeah, you know, you ain't too bad behind no wheels. Sorry. Man, you're a great driver. <laughs> oh, man. I killed like three people so far. <laughs> the bumper's like hanging off. Whoops. Get a load of that bait. Nice. That's a 42 Jefferson. Man, cars were like fucking weird. You should grab yourself some lockpicks over at Giuseppe's. Why didn't? Okay, does okay Giuseppe's is just right here. I was thinking like he was across the street or something. I was like, why didn't we just drive there first? Welcome to Giuseppe's General Store. Uh, me first. Paradise. You name it, he's got it. Even... Hey, oh, were you still talking? I'm sorry. <laughs> he's uh, straight up, right? Yes, sir. All the way. This is Vito, my oldest friend. This is Giuseppe, the best safe cracker in Empire uh, Bay. please. How are you? The uh, papers for you? Yeah, they are. You got them finished already? It was a pain in the ass, but sure, they're done. Well, thanks. This really gonna work? Nobody from the army will bother you again, trust me. You see? what I tell you? Here's the money. Take your papers, Vito. Give me. Uh, we need a set of lockpicks, too. That we do. And guess who's paying for them? You? I don't have any fucking what? I have like twenty seven dollars. How do you do? Jesus, you want me to pay seven dollars out of my twenty seven for lock picks? Yeah, at the time that's probably like forty fifty bucks. But you can test it right now. Here, take this lock. The, what, like, what if I break it? That's like two dollars. I don't want to pay all that. The time is like eight nine dollars. <laughs> like he actually just says that. What? For the time, this is like <laughs> eight or nine dollars. <laughs> They're like, what the fuck are you talking? This, this is just two dollars. That's what this means. 
There we go. Oh, that's neat. Be around, Giuseppe. Goodbye, Mr. Benedict. Easy, huh? Don't worry. You'll get the hang of it. I do it all the time when I lock my keys in the car. Okay. You still feel like snagging that car? You kidding me? Absolutely. Well, here's your chance. I'll just smash the window. So, yeah, fuck these lockpicks. They're expensive. I don't want to waste them. On picking locks. <laughs> if I can just fucking smash that shit in. Okay. And I got it. How they fucking know? were they just around? Ah. Ooh, I like this like slow mo. How do I get out of it? Oh, there we go. Are they shooting? That's a bit Fuck. drastic. Yeah, I was like, you steal a car and you get shot at by the police. Fuck, Christ. Like, I understand wanting to get me, but... Uh. Oh! Nah, it's fine. It's fine. All right. Yeah, the driving in this is quite, uh... Stiff. Alright, let's go find ourselves a body shop. They provide the kind of services we're looking for. Hey, what are those? Services. Don't worry about it. I what type of services? Just find any body shop. Fixing your really rushed. fucked up thing. Ah. Yeah, the icy roads I think contribute to this, but yeah, the 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 ah, god damn it, <laughs> the driving is relatively unresponsive. It's gonna take me a while to get used to it. Yeah. Just because yeah. I'm so used to right much more. Uh, what? What? <laughs> What? What? Where did? Wha, wha, whatever. So, but they're like they're fucking puppy guarding it. Like, what am <laughs> I supposed to do? No puppy guarding. It's not fair. You can't do that. But they are though. It's bullshit. Like, how am I supposed to get to the body shop if it fucking literally will not let me? All right, let's try this again. Yeah, let's just. Maybe if I don't crash in anything, then it'll. I see, is there some sort of like. You can get like a new license plate or something to make your car not wanted. Yeah, precisely. That's a, that's a kind of a cool mechanic. Puppy, excuse me. Puppy excuse guarding me, excuse it. Me, excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. There we go. Hey, good afternoon. Jesus Christ, that is I, I can't I can't. What you looking for? Man, you yeah you just fucked that thing. For you, no problem. Uh, Z. Uh, oh wait, I got it. Uh. <laughs> 62 my favorite <laughs> number <laughs> <laughs> oh you sly yeah, there, dog there we go <laughs> <laughs> uh, 68 bring it by right. anytime anytime what if it's during Four your mom's funeral <laughs> hey hey don't be a pussy. Right. Your mom's she dead, but I still got a car to fix. They probably have some work for you. All right. Where is he? He owns a junkyard over in Riverside. You can't miss him. Nah. Ah. Ah. Hey. <laughs> Who's that guy? Nice. What guy? The guy at the body shop. Oh, Tommy. He's my buddy's nephew. He's kind of quiet, but let me tell you, the kid's some hell of a dancer. Saw him at the old dance hall in Oyster Bay a couple of weeks ago. He had all the broads going nuts. Do I detect a hint of uh, jealousy? Are you kidding? I don't need no dance moves. I got charm, my friend. Here, I'll give you some of my lines, so maybe you won't have to spend so many nights with Rosie Palm and her five sisters. <laughs> is, I've never heard that before. Is that, that a before. euphemism that's for amazing. jerking off? Yes, that's beautiful. Holy shit, that's gorgeous. I love it. I'm going to use that every day for the Do rest of my life. Do you remember what it was? Yeah. Rosie Palm and what? And her five sisters. Oh, okay. This is your fingers. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, oh, come on. Did it. Are you proud of me? Oh, this yeah. one never fails. Hey, baby, that's a nice outfit. It look good crumpled up at the foot of my bed in the morning. And this works for you. Oh, here, here's a good one. Hey, do you know the difference between sex and conversation? No? You want to go back to my place and talk? You got problems, you know that? How about this one? Why don't we go back to my place and play house? You be the door and I'll slam you. <laughs> oh, that was bad. Hey, I've never heard that before. That was pretty solid. Soft. Hey, I really like <laughs> anal sex. Do you also like <laughs> anal sex? Oh, God. 
That woman does not like anal sex. <laughs> Let me tell you something about that woman. Just drive true to you. Ah, I like it when women put the, my penis inside of their mouth. Do you like that as well? <laughs> <laughs> Let's slam. Hey, look who's hey, here. Hey, Mikey boy, what's going on? Shit, Mike, you can wash your fucking hands once in a while. Now I need a fucking bed. Hey, I've been working. Working people occasionally get dirty, you know. Besides, I just wiped them off. With what? The same fucking rag you used to clean the toilet, you filthy fuck? Put a lid on it. What, what are you, from the health department, or you want to do some business? <laughs> business, of course. This, this here's my friend Vito. Vito, this is Mike Bruski. But don't shake his hand. I ain't got that much soap at home. Nice to meet you, Vito. Hey, uh, me and Vito go way back. He just come back from overseas and he needs some cash. So I figure he can help with your uh, supply problem. I can vouch for him. Uh-huh. Okay. Joe told you about our side business, right? Yeah. I only want regular cars, nothing fancy. You get a cut of every car. I take as many as I can handle. And don't bring no cops around, okay? If they follow you here, I don't know your ass from Jesus. You get me? Got it. God damn it, Mike! You put your grubby mitts on my fucking coat. I paid a fortune for this thing. All right, calm down or I'll stick them up your ass, you sissy. You know, dry cleaning costs Jesus these days. Jesus Christ. Plenty. And who knows if they can even get this filled you out. You shut up. Vito, listen to me. I need a Walter Coupe today. I got a few people looking for parts, but I can't find a car. Because you don't know where to look. Every time I drive down Hunters, I see one parked by a bar there. I think the place is called the Lone Star. Isn't that a move in your neighborhood? I'll stick out like a sore thumb. All right, look, I'll give you 350 bucks for it. It's worth the risk, right? 400. <laughs> All right, deal. Alfredo, come on, let's go. Andiamo. Meantime, I'll be sending you the cleaning bill for my coat. Yeah, I'll change my address, you rat prick. Okay, listen up. This is your maiden voyage, so to speak. So try not to fuck it up, man. Eh? Here, Vito, take this, just in case. Hey, nice. Hey, Mike, you mind if I test this thing out here? Sure. Knock yourself out. Here you go. Aim for that old wreck over there. What? You're, you're cool with me shooting this? Just explodes. Hey, you ain't a bad shot. Hey, Vito, see if you can hit the gas tank. I did already. Oh, but that time it blew up. That thing. There's a Polak joke there, but I'll leave it alone. Oh, yeah, that reminds me. Fuck you. All right, that's enough shooting. <laughs> that yeah, reminds me of fuck you. Are we leaving? Yo, bitch, I asked you a fucking question. Okay, well, um, by the way, speaking of questions, I have a question for you, Alex. Yeah, Jake. <laughs> Guess what time it is. <laughs> It's you hate yourself a clock. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> and also but it's jobs. also time for jobs. Well, for jobs next episode. It's actually time to stop jobs right now if we're being if we're being accurate, if we're being precise. About <laughs> jobs. jobs. <laughs> Just one bed. <laughs> Is that where you sleep? <laughs> where do you sleep? <laughs> wait, so that, that door you just is... sleep under the table? That, so wait, that other door is the door to the outside, right? Yeah. You sure? sure. Oh. Well, that's just a There's a bathroom. Yeah, no, that's it. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah, is that the... Yeah, that's...